What's going on guys, SM Outdoors uh, bringing you a video. Uh, this is a review video after a thousand miles on my new tires. Uh, I recently picked up some Nito Ridge Grapplers. Um, those of you that follow my channel know I've been a huge advocate of um, General Grabber AT2s. They no longer make them. I didn't like the tread pattern or the look of the AT3s and the other Generals, so I decided to give these Ridge Grapplers a try. Um, got about five, six hundred miles on the highway with them. They're not loud at all. They're they're very, very smooth riding tire. I mean, obviously it's going to be louder, you know, than a passenger tire, but it's definitely not anything absurd or doesn't sound like a mud tire. It doesn't sound like that choppy sound. Um, and then I also got um, about ten miles of pretty hardcore off-road type stuff too. Um, you know, going through creeks, mud pits, uh, you know, rocky trails and whatnot, without any issue at all. Um, you know staying in two-wheel drive the entire time so so far again i'm only a thousand miles in um haven't taken them in the snow yet um generally a, a mt isn't the greatest in the snow but i heard that these actually aren't too bad um those of you that are not familiar the ridge grappler is like an at mt hybrid um so i'm looking forward to see how these things are in the snow but with that said i'll give you a peek of how they look on the truck um and then i'll throw up some video footage of these guys in action So here they are guys, uh, mine are in 285-70-17, I just washed the truck, so um, they are mounted to Method Envies, uh, 17 inch wheels obviously, uh, these I got from Custom Offset, and um, other than taking a really really long time for the order to get here, they were saying 7 to 10 days, it took about a month, um, they did come in shipped perfectly, packaged perfectly. Uh, the bead balance was dead on. I double checked the balance before I mounted and aligned it. Uh, they were dead on. Um, these are equivalent to about a 33 inch tire and I'm on a uh, Bilstein two and a half inch uh, level. So here's the truck itself. It's a 2019 F-150 Lariat uh, 501A package with the 3.5 EcoBoost. And again, just another close-up of these guys in the tread pattern here. As you can see, it's very, very similar to an AT, but with bigger gaps and wider pieces, So, it, which which brings the MT part. So it's truly an AT-MT hybrid. Um, my offset is zero, so they stick out past my fender, but not much. It doesn't throw rocks or anything at the truck at all. 